Fuck, it's so much work. And I have no clue how I manage. Good morning. After a few days of just parking here, editing videos, relaxing, I finally move on for some reasons. First of all, I'm standing in the middle of a lagoon uh, with some dunes, as you can see here. And I just noticed that for the first time, um, quite a lot of water is coming in. It's for sure not getting all the way up here, but still I don't want to risk not getting out anymore. Um, I mean, I feel quite safe here because of... There are cars driving as well, so there's like a little road here. But the water comes surprisingly high and I need to go to the city anyway to fill up and to restock everything. So yeah, I will do this today and let's see what I come across on the way. So I drove out easily, that was not a problem at all. Here are my tracks. So it's not deep, the only part, I think this here, could have easily, easily got me into trouble. Look how, it's almost like quicksand here. It actually looks like the water is still coming in. So, maybe it is good that I leave. The whole way where I came in is already full of water. So there is a second way out. I've seen that when I um, when I arrived, but still, it's I could not go out where I came in. So yes, it is good that I leave.
Oh yeah, I um, was looking for a spot and I found one a little bit further up but I thought there's a way down here and it looked okay but then there was a dune and I thought okay I just have to drive a little faster and then there, there are rocks on the road road <laughs> so I had to stop and I had to back up and um, yeah it would not be a big problem not at all but my rear diff lock just decided to to let me down that's not cool so yeah now I have to somehow get out here without a diff lock I don't like that but I have to manage somehow Okay, let's try. In situations like this, the only thing to do is relax, drink water, and enjoy the beautiful view over there. It's quite nice. It's a nice spot to get stuck. <laughs> Let me show you what I've done so far. I have freed the back track actually goes a little down this I have to tidy up a little more that's not good yet same on the other side and also here in the middle and the plan is to put the sandboards underneath the um, or behind the tires most probably on the back I hope that the back is the right decision maybe or maybe the front because the back tire is hopefully on grippy surface soon again while the front tires are a little bit further away i have to think about that <laughs> i'm not sure yet it's not too bad the situation it's okay i haven't used my sandboards i could still deflate the tires which would help most probably but I'm also a little bit lazy let's see first option sandboards and removing sand enjoy enjoy
Oh, I get so much work. And I have no clue how I manage. Right now it's... Fuck, look at that. I'm really deep in. Luckily I have quite a lot of space underneath. But I have to get rid of that sand. And I think a little bit more here. And if you can see that, the sun is almost behind that. It's not a hill, it's just here, but then I'm not in the sun anymore. Maybe that's good, but maybe that's maybe that's nasty as well. And I hope that I will be fine once I'm, I'm somewhere here. Hopefully. Yeah, those rocks are hard enough. I think I put some rocks underneath the tires as well. I try everything at, at once because I don't want to try a few times or oh, more times than I did already. I put you here. Now I put you here. Please remind me that I don't forget you. Thank you. Semi success, only half a success. I came into the soft sand too far, so I hope that I can just go back a little bit and then my plan is to turn around here because this it's perfect. So I go a little bit further down again and then. Hopefully come back up. Okay, I try something maybe stupid now, but the car is sticking to the right side where the dune is. There's so much more friction, so I can't steer 
around here. It's crazy. So what I try is I try to go a bit further back and then I try to go up here. It's like one foot, a little bit more there, but it's rock solid here. And once I'm up here, I can comfortably turn around. Like I'm sweating like crazy. <laughs> it's also a nice experience, I love it. Because I, I take it so easy because I have, today I have refilled everything and um, the main road is not far away as well. So that would not be an issue. I have enough fuel with me. I could still fix the, the diff lock on the back. There are so many options I still have left. Yeah, I, I'm not stressed with it. Actually, it's really good fun, but it's a hard workout. So let's see how the next plan goes. And if it works, thank you, Matt's off-road recovery team. I learned a lot from you, thank you. That was a lovely adventure. I'm sweating now, I need water and food. First I will collect everything. Second camera. So I shoveled half a dune and almost got stuck here again. Well, that was good fun, playing in the sand. Okay, I think I have everything. The last bit should not be an issue. Fingers crossed. And and you go back up here. See you at the spot. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, leave me a like. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. And of course, a subscription would be wonderful. Thank you so much and see you in the next video.